everybody. It's Darlene Taylor, the Recycled Mom, and today I'm going to show you my trip to Sharp Shopper Grocery Outlet. There are only a few locations, as you can see from this shopping bag that I have laid out here. They're mainly in Pennsylvania, and there's three locations in Winchester, or I mean in Virginia. <laughs> Mine is Winchester. <laughs> we love this store. It has some super great deals. They usually get the overstock from other grocery stores factory rejects or things like that and that could only mean because maybe there was a misprint on a box. Since we are getting ready to start homeschool again, I'm going to show you some of our favorites that we have around for snacks and breakfast during our homeschool days. <laughs> so I'm going to start up here with some of the smaller stuff. We run on a syrup very quickly so I just picked up some syrup and this is $1.39 for the bottle. I picked up mustard today <laughs> because Elizabeth has been asking me for mustard. So I made sure to take care of that and that's 99 cents. And all of the spices at the store are 99 cents. And I picked up garlic salt and also onion powder and onion salt. We go through these, we go through these pretty fast. And then I needed some canned vegetables for a casserole. And I got some Blue Lake green beans. These are two for a dollar for these um, 14 ounce cans. This is also a favorite of ours, popcorn chicken. This is by far the best brand in our house, TJ Farms Select. And we will usually cook a whole bag for my three kids and I'll usually eat some too. That's more than enough, it's very filling and they are $3.99 a bag. We got two bags today, but you only see one because one is already in the oven <laughs> for lunch. And that, I was really excited to see these. And if you haven't tried these, you really should because you literally crack an egg into the cup and then you put all of these ingredients in it. This one comes with sausage, vegetables, potatoes, and cheese. You mix it all up and then you microwave it. I think it takes about 90 seconds all together and you have like a little omelet in a cup. It is super quick, super easy. My kids can do it themselves. These were 99 cents a piece and normally they're $1.50 to $2 um, at Walmart. That was a really good deal. I was happy to find soft pretzels. My daughter, Elizabeth, especially loves pretzels. So we were excited to find baked soft pretzels. These would be a good snack for us. And these were 99 cents a box. There's six of them in there. And then we found some double cinnamon French toast sticks. My son, Jimmy, loves French toast sticks. These are $1.99 for the box. And there are 20 sticks in there. So that would be an average of four servings. They, they count a serving as five sticks. Moving back here, we bought Cheez-Its, um, Pepper Jack. These were $1.49 a box. And we got Pepper Jack, and by mistake, I had picked up these. I thought that I was getting regular ones, but I got Buffalo Wing. We did try them. They are not bad. Um, just I was just expecting to get regular cheeses, but anyway, that's that's not bad at all. They will get eaten for sure. Another good find. This was something different. These are lemon Nilla wafers, and this is exciting. We love lemon. We love Nilla wafers. So this was an exciting to try, and at a price of two for a dollar. I'm only out a dollar if we don't like them. These are some of the regular items that Sharp Shopper carries. These are assorted cheese ends, and there are different cheese ends in there. There's different cheeses. There's um, Kojak, Swiss, cheddar. Sometimes there might be provolone in there, and there's Munster cheese. Um, sometimes we get found something that tasted like taco cheese one time. So it's kind of one of the things about Sharp Shopper. You kind of don't know what you're going to get. <laughs> And I was excited to find these again. These are already hard cooked, hard boiled eggs, and they were 59 cents for each package. So I picked up four of these. I'm usually always eating hard boiled eggs. That's, you know, when you're a mom on the go trying to get some protein in, <laughs> this is a great, great snack, something that's portable and you can kind of eat it um, on the go. Something else, uh, there's another one. These are pepperoni slices and can see that they fit you know perfectly on a cracker they're great snacking again the pepperoni and the cheese together is a wonderful snack this container is 284 that tends to be a better deal than buying a package and I forgot to tell you that this whole container was three dollars and eleven cents 
We also got these beef salami slices. These were three for a dollar. I did buy six, only four made it home <laughs> because Elizabeth and I were hungry. <laughs> These are great for me, having meat and cheese, you know, trying to be on keto diet and everything. This is great for a little snack. We picked up some more apples. These were, um, there's the price. I mean, these were $1.99. Usually we get Gala, but they had Fuji today, so this was, that's fine. We like Fuji as well. This was another awesome find. Uh, we're excited about trying these as well. These would be great for a snack. Never heard of these before. However, they sound absolutely divine. <laughs> these are French toast bagel. These are going to be filled with sweet cream cheese and these are plain bread middles and they're going to be filled with macaroni and cheese. So this is going to be something interesting but fun and good to try for a snack. We love it when we find these at Sharp Shopper. These P3 portable packs or some of the other ones that are like this where they have they're divided into sections with like, you know, nuts and meat, cheese, um, granola, dried fruit in some of them. But they had these today. These were $79 a piece. Usually they're at least $1.50 or more in the stores. And when we see them, we try to stock up on them. But of course, these don't last very long, especially if, every, if everybody has one for a snack one day. I picked up five of those and I also picked up five of these. Cracker Barrel cheese pairing plates. And these are fun because they have crackers and cheese and a cookie, and we love spice cookies, so that's nice too. These are 79 cents a package. They carry lots of pasta, gluten-free items. Um, this bag was only 69 cents for wide ribbon egg noodles. They have other ones there that are, there's a different brand there as well, but usually they're around 69, 79 cents per bag. Um, this <laughs> was at the checkout. My kids love cow tails. I don't know if any of you know if you ever had those. These are mini cow tails. These are perfect to fit maybe in a lunch box. But again, these are just a quick little, just a quick little snack, quick little treat. And that container was $1.44. We, we opened this on the way home, so some are missing. <laughs> um, we also got bananas. Now, bananas and some of the produce at Sharp Shopper. You can get some really good deals, but then there are other things that are just like really expensive, and I think that's might might be where they make up some of their money uh, from having things you know so cheap. Um, these bananas were 59 cents a pound, where I can usually get them at Walmart for a lot cheaper, you know, 49, 47 cents. This is some of our favorite. The turn this around the right way. Nature's Own Butter Bread, and this was $2.19 for a loaf of bread. It's a lot cheaper than what you find in the stores. Sometimes the stores have it for $2.79, $2.49. So it's, you're still saving a little bit. So that is my haul from Sharp Shopper today. My total was $68 for all of that. If you'd like to see more ideas of what we have for snacks and what we do for our homeschool day, click like and subscribe to my channel for new videos. And this is Vlogist Day 16. Happy Vlogist, everybody. Thanks for tuning in.